Hey guys, here's a um, I remember making one of these similar circuits quite a while ago and uh, these ones are actually for uh, wireless power so if I take them out there, these are colour coded these coils if I put a battery between here and here uh, that will come on this uh, will work wirelessly Ooh. I'll try and make this so it's slightly easier okay right what we got here this is the old familiar <clears throat> This is uh, what they call a jewel thief. I wonder if I just take the sc scope off it for a second. It's running at um, between 60 and 61 kilohertz. Uh, what I did, uh, I used the. Um, I've tried doing this before, uh, a little while ago, <clears throat> and I didn't get anywhere with it. Uh, only because I was I think I was just making it more complicated than what it is. I got myself a, a core out of a Xbox. So I figured it'd be pretty good. It's, it's, it's quite magnetic as well. I've been testing a lot of my cores with the iron. Um really see how magnetic they are around. Anyway, I saw a lot because a while ago I made one of these. This is pretty much my first circuit that I built. And how this works is if I say um, the light, the, the, these came out of my um, thermostat control for the heating system. And so I know it's no good uh, because I've had to change them. So I connect down to the ends of there and put this by that. I don't know if you can see, but we have ourselves a. Yeah, a bit of wireless electricity. And it's basically like a jewel feed, except this is just using this ring instead. Uh, like I say, that battery is uh, is pretty dead, and so that's that's pulling that out of there. That's pretty good. This one here, uh, this battery, I'm not so sure about how dead or alive it is, but it does give it does. better results. A moment ago it was just doing that for itself I thought oh that's, that's pretty good there we go so uh, so yeah and I've used the two uh, 2N2222 because it's just a general purpose um, as you can see I've used these uh, blue LEDs there's well, I've six of them basically in parallel I think now I don't think you're supposed to do it like that but uh, it's just for this, just for this little. I, all, all I wanted to do really was uh, I got I got a few more. I'm gonna just stack them into this to see if these come on as well. Uh, I could put this up, up here, couldn't I? It doesn't really matter on this board as this project is just building a, an infrared transmitter to see if any of my infrared receivers work. Uh, Okay, the wires come off. So I think we get into the um, get into its limit though, especially as the connection isn't so great. Oh, they're pretty bright again. Okay, so the connection wasn't so great. Oh, so we got a uh, so that's five, six, seven, eight, eight LEDs running from the one from the one battery there. Not terribly bright, but certainly bright enough the camera's got to compensate okay. yeah so the simple I'm quite chuffed with that anyway there's my jewel thief I'll, uh, I'll draw a little circuit there we go there you can see it. <coughs> quite a while now. 
I might just leave that to see how long it goes for. Let's see what voltage is in the battery. This bench has been tied twice today. Back to that's a reasonable condition. And twice it's been messed up again. So let's put it on the test it while it's under load as well if I can without disturbing it. So can you see that? Yep. On DC, yep. Seven point two nine. Let's just take it out of there for a second. Oh, 1.34 so it's quite uh it's got quite a bit of charge in it then this really maybe i should get that one that i know is here yeah, let's let's try this now we'll see what the voltage is on this first uh, down there 1.1617 but we're not going to bother with the last bits so i don't think that's just going to fit in and stay on by itself though because It's quite. Can't get it down. Okay, this isn't. It's just not going to play the game. So if I can just get my hand out of the way. There you go. So they're all quite bright too. Hmm. And that was with 1.1 volt, wasn't it? Yeah, that's pretty good. Considering how many of these bulbs there are. And, uh. Not going warm, is it? Nah. Uh. That won't even uh, light up the LED display on my on my uh, thermostat. So that's um, five, six, seven, eight. That's nine, nine LEDs now, including that one that you can't see. It's my hand in the way down there. Anyway. Thief. Cheers guys.